Installing and setting up Metasploit Community Edition on Windows 8, this time on Metasploit Minute. This Metasploit Minute is brought to you by Hack5 and viewers like you. Support us directly at hakshop.com. Welcome to Metasploit Minute, the breakdown on breaking in. I'm your host Rob Fuller, but you can call me Mobix. In this minute, we're going to be setting up Metasploit Community Edition on Windows 8. The very first thing we have to do is, is download the installer. And you can do that, let me show you, at rapid7.com. They give you two options. One is Metasploit Pro. It's a seven-day trial that you can try out the cool version, cool features of Metasploit Pro, as well as Metasploit Community Edition. I've clicked through this and, and gone through and filled out all the information you got to fill out. So we already have the installer downloaded. And this really is just the next, next, next finish that we're going to be going through. But let me show you just some of the little tweaks that are going to have to happen. A yes for UAC prompting. Next. I agree. So this is kind of the first important piece. You want to put this somewhere uh, on your disk where antivirus is not going to pull it away. So if you have an antivirus installed on your system, um, this is an exploit development or exploit framework. So by default, it has a bunch of exploits in it. Now, your AV is definitely not going to like this. So if you put this anywhere on your system that AV is going to scan it, especially during installation, it's going to rip it right out. So either disable your antivirus or put an exclusion for this particular directory. Now, this SSL port um, is where you're going to be hosting the Community Edition web application. Now, if you have anything on 70, 3790 already, um, which you probably don't, um, you can change it right here, but um, it's best to leave it as default. Next, this is your um, SSL certificate. Next, it's just basic self-signed stuff. And install. Now we just wait. All right, now that our installer is finally done, uh, we're going to access the Metasploit web UI wiki or whatever. It's going to be the, the web UI for um, the community edition that we talked about. So finish, it should pop up. Let's get this a little bigger so you guys can see it. Ooh, not that button. There we go. Welcome to Metasploit, blah, 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 blah. We click on the little button and we set up our very first username. So. One of the big features of, of the Community Edition and Express and Pro is that it's multi-user, right? So there's not just one way to get to this thing. So we set up, um, let's just say hack5 as our username and our really long password that we're definitely going to remember. Hack5, msf at hack5.org, metasploit, minute. Create an account, done. So this is where we have to get a product key for the Community Edition. If you have a Community Edition, you can still use um, Metasploit Console, and we'll show that an another time without doing a product key. But just getting a product key, it's pretty simple. You, s you have to input the same information again. License, here we go. Daytime number 8675309. All right, we got our license. Copy, paste activate and that's it we're good to go so that's it um what do you think hit me up at msf at hack5.org and stay tuned to metasploitminute.com for more shows like these until then i'm ubix and i'll be hacking till the cows come home Mm-hmm. <laughs>